Hello, welcome to Stereo Pixel. In this video, we will discuss how to render wireframe in Maya. Rendering wireframe is very important for CG artists to show the topology of their models. Unlike other softwares like 3ds Max and uh, ZBrush, rendering wireframe in Maya is a bit tricky. Here I will show you the easy and most effective way to render wireframe. First of all, select the model and go to the rendering module. Under tool, click on assign outline and add new tool outline. So as I can see, a new outline has generated. Go to the attribute editor. Select the PFX Toon Shape One tab, and here we will get uh, all settings for the Toon Render. First of all, select the line with value and put the value to 0 0.02. Select line offset and put the value 0.25. Drag the menu down. Come to the crease lines section. Uh, I wanna put my wireframe color to black, so don't change the color. You can also select any color you wish from the color palette. Select the crease line width value and crank it down to 0.7. Uh, select crease angle minimum and crease angle maximum values and crank down to zero. Now you can already see that in our viewport uh, wireframe has been generated according to the edge flow of the model but still there is uh, one thing that I have to do and that is check off hard creases only if we put hard creases only on it will only show you the hard edges of your model but if I change my models hard edges to soft edges it will then not show all the wireframe of my model so turn off hard creases only and keep back facing creases on okay so now if i uh, render the model from this angle first of all i will select the perspective camera and i'll go to the environment and change the background color to any color except black because we have put our wireframe color to black so change the background color to uh, maybe light gray turn on the resolution gate and now if I render my model I will see a clean wireframe has been generated for my model I can rotate my model from any angle and render So Toon Shader not only gives you the wireframe for your model but also if I select my model and increase the subdivision level if I go to polygons under mesh smooth we'll see my model is facing some difficulties and that is perfectly alright because it's all about the normals so what I'll do I will select my model first of all I will undo last operation I will select my model I will go to display polygons and face normals 
and if I check my model I'll see most of the normals are facing inward and that's why my surface is looking like black so first of all I'll select the surface and under normals I will select reverse so it will reverse all inward normals to outward now select the face once again and go to normals and set to face so now if I select my model and put the smooth node I'll see my model is now perfectly alright go to display polygons and turn off face normals I'm sorry select the model first press G on your keyboard you will see as my model's subdivision has been increased my toon shader's subdivision has also increased and it's now showing the model's present subdivision level in wireframe so now if I render my model I'll see it's looking perfectly alright it's showing the wireframe very smoothly and efficient way So that is all about uh, how to uh, render wireframe in Maya. Hope you have enjoyed this video. Thank you.